Hey guys, welcome to my new video. In this video, I'm gonna show how to create this animation with using After Effects. Let's get started. So guys, welcome back and first one, let's create new solid layer. Add name Elements 3D, click OK. Go to FX, Video Copilot, Element. And go to Scene Setup, Import 3D Model and choose 3D Model, Open. Don't change any settings, click OK. And normalize size we have some problems with 3d model let's fix it first let's open inside select all materials go to down and click draw back face also this material back face and screen glass also back face and script and screen background you can see it works and flash back face and material 4. Okay, here we go. Okay, Textoons is down. Let's click OK and go to project. Select this image display, drag and drop this icon for create new composition. Quality full. Let's right click composition settings and write vertical sizes. Click OK. Let's right click Go to transform and fit to comp. Back to main composition and select the display composition, drag and drop into composition here and hide for now. Select this element, go to effects control and custom layers and custom texture maps. Choose here layer 1 display image and go to scene setup. Hold control and click here for choose the display material. Let's see. Okay. And go to Diffuse, Textures here, and click Non-Set. Click here, and Custom Layer 1. And OK. So, right now we can't see here Texture. For fix this, go to Basic Settings, Diffuse Color, Change to White. And here we go. It works. Also, if you not see this Texture here, choose Model. Go to Texture Settings, and change Texture Mapping Box. So let's go to presets and environment, basic environments, and let's choose environment light. Okay, let's click environment. Nice, click OK. So in this time, let's create new background layer with solid, add name background, click OK. Move to behind layer and go to FS presets, source FA gradient ramp, choose gradient ramp, use for background. And colors, let's choose like this color. And ramp shape, choose red ramp. And swap colors. Choose point, move to center, and this, move like this. And for remove these background noises, let's write ramp scatter 200. And go to FX presses, search effect noise. Choose noise, use for background. And right here, one. Okay, it works. So in this time, go to color and choose color like this. Click OK and select element 3D model. So let's go to word transform and let's zoom to a little bit like this. Okay, and move to down. And let's create new person keyframe and select element 3D, press U for C keyframes and Go to Fave Keyframes and move to up. Select Keyframes, make it easy. And go to Graph Editor, choose Graph Make Smooth Animation. And back to Keyframe, select Last Keyframe, move to right. And back to Graph Editor again, make Graph like this. Move to left more. And in this time, let's create new camera tool. And don't change any settings, I will use presses 50 millimeters, click OK. And let's select camera 1, let's right click, go to camera, create orbit null. And let's hold control, double click pen behind icon for move to anchor point to center, click station tool, and in this time press P, create new passing keyframe, go to here, and zoom to model like this. Make it keyframes easy. Go to graph editor 
and make smooth graph. Back to chief frame, select first chief frame for null object, move to the left. Okay, and this time select element 3D and open world rotation and change rotation like this. And go to first second. Let's create Y rotation chief frame. Again, press U for C active chief frames. And go to here, change rotation like this. Make it chief frames easy. Let's see. Okay, we can change rotation like this. And go to here again. Let's change to right side like this. Select middle chief frame, move to center. Okay, select chief frame, go to graph editor and make it smooth graph. Okay, that's better. And in this time, select this null object. And let's hold shift press R, create X, Y, Z rotation Q frames. And select Q frames, move to left and chain rotation like this. And also add new passing keyframes here. And Y rotation keyframe with change rotation for show this side and a little bit to null object. Okay, let's see. Nice. And select rotation keyframes, make it easy and preview animation. Okay, and this time select this null object Q frames and move to here and let's see. And we can use in this time for this null Q frames, let's see. Okay, and let's press T, change opacity zero, move to right. And let's create opacity keyframes. Go to here, change like this, and make the keyframes easy. Select iPhone layer, move to right. Okay, preview animation. So, for add more dynamics, let's select these elements 3D really and change rotation like this. Okay, that's good. So we can create other scenes with this Elements 3D and select this camera. We can control camera with these tools. Also press C in keyboard and let's zoom to like this. And select this Elements 3D, go to FS control and let's change. Okay, and let's change view like this. Go to first second, create Y rotation keyframe and go to four seconds change view like this okay not bad and select background let's hide select elements 3d go to render settings and ambient occlusion enable ambient and intensity 10 for realistic shadows and physical environment let's show in background and go to scene setup and presence environment background lights and let's choose this light for cinematic views, click OK and change exports here and open rotate environment, change environment like this and create Y, Z, X rotation keyframes for environment, go to here and change environments like this. Okay, that's good. And select this camera, let's open inside, camera options, enable depot field and blur level 200. And aperture, let's change aperture like this and Fox distance. Okay, let's see. Let's create Fox distance shift frame, go to here and change distance like this. Okay, not bad. And select this camera. Let's open all transforms, create new keyframe, and go to here 
and moved it down like this preview animation okay not bad we can keep this for only two seconds so guys thanks for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe to the channel like video leave comments and have a good day good luck